All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're up early. It's apparently it's uh, it was 5:30 when I woke up. It's probably almost six now, but it's still dark out. Sun's just coming up. We got the kayak on the roof. We got all of our fishing gear. We're gonna be going fishing at Braunov and Boat Launch. Probably shouldn't have said that in the video. I'm not sure yet, but yeah, it's just like a little beach. We're gonna pull down and put the kayak out and everything. Try to catch some fish. The weather's supposed to be good. There's a little bit of fog. Hopefully it's not super super bad on the lake. They said the southern is gonna tow Yeah. Let's do it. I'll see when it gets a big Alright you guys, I thought the fog was settling out, but it's not. So I'm not gonna go out into the deep just yet. We're gonna go around to the right, fish off this point. It's there's a big ass point right here with some rocks on it. Right there. So we're gonna fish off that, go off into the cove with some grass. Should do us well. Just had a whole bunch of big markings come up to our worm on our left side on the beast pole. Didn't touch it. I don't think I'm gonna have to check my bait in a second. Got the drop shot out on the right. Yeah, but just look at that view. Like holy cow. A whole bunch of fog to the left, all around us. Got that beautiful sun coming through over there. Alright guys, so I kind of did the opposite of what I said I was going to do and I actually went down to the deeper water and tried. I got a whole bunch of markings and stuff looking at my bait, but no bites. I even saw like a school of bass or something, pretty big bites. But right now we're going to go over to these half dead weeds, see if there's anything in them. And then we'll uh, figure out a game plan, bleh, game plan from there. But we're going to be using this little chartreuse on the top, white, red, top popper on the bait caster. Guys, I'm getting a hit on this top popper. He came up and smashed it. Oh, I didn't go for it again. He's writing on these weeds. Oh no. Writing on the weeds up here in the shower. Let's see if we can get him to hit again. Dang it, I think my hooks are messed up. Yeah, they are. Okay, there we go. I wanna get a little bit closer. It's literally right in front of the boat. Those little weeds. I'm really upset. And he swiped for it like three times. At least we know what they're in here. And we got plenty more weeds for that one. This little bunch came from, so. Oh yeah, right on the top hopper, guys. Oh, don't let them get off, it's a bass. Wow, they're in like two feet of water right now, are you kidding? First fish on our new bait caster too. Let's go guys, always oh, going for the bushes. Go for the weeds. Oh crap. Oh yeah. Dudes, on the top hopper. Where's my mat? He's right on the boat. Oh, it's a nice smallie, come on. Where's my mat, come on. Come on, trust the net. Oh, get in the net, buddy. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, nice little dinker. We're not skunk today, boys. I wanna get off the spot real quick. Let's see this bad boy. I don't wanna get a hook him in there. Nice. He's just a little dinker, but it's beautiful. Let's get this, oh, he just bit me. Let's get this grass out of his mouth. Out of his feet. We're probably gonna switch to, well, we're gonna use it until it doesn't work anymore, but look at that beautiful fish. It's a beautiful fish right there. Nice little smallie. Let's let him go. Oh, there he goes. Let's go. We are not skunk today on the big old lake. I can't believe they're in like one to two feet of water. All right, you guys, we got the battery pack on. I think I'm beating a dead horse over here on this pile where I first got the bite. This one where we got over here, it's over to the right a little bit where we're top popping. 
So over here, actually, uh, the fish was actually bigger because it kind of jumped out of the water a little bit. I do wish I brought my frogs. I, didn't, I really didn't think they were going to be hitting all this weeds and stuff and vegetation for some reason. Like, I've been reading up on everything. I really didn't think they were going to, but it looks like there's some in here. Let's try to get a, big, a bigger one. We're literally in three feet of water right now. Just so you guys know. Alright, we got the spook bait on. Hopefully it's not too big. I wouldn't imagine it is. I can cast for days with this bad boy. All the way out there, that'd be a hell of a fight. Oh, oh, go for it again. That was huge. Oh my God, please go for it again. Please. That was a huge bass. Please, please, please. Oh, I should let it sit. Dang it. I love topwater lures. Oh, come on. I'm gonna cast it back. Surely does it come all the way out here with it. That's the second fish that we've missed. That saddens me. Might have to throw the drop shot really soon too. Might even have to switch over to that crawl imitation I was talking about. Ooh, right on the edge, come on. Tap, tap. Oh, that was a huge fish. That might have been a pike. Yes, go for it, please. Go for it one more time. He went for it twice. That fish was absolutely huge. Oh my god. Oh, they're over there. They're literally in the weeds. Oh, he's still on it. He's still on it. It's a pike. No. <laughs> Why did he miss it? It had to be a little pike or something. That was absolutely huge. And we, <laughs> he didn't get hooked up. It's like they're swiping at it, but not hitting it. Oh, that's a big one. Yes. Stay on, boy. Always dragging me. Holy crap. It's a big one, guys. It's a really big one. Let's go. Stay on. He's coming right towards us. Oh, oh no. He's going in the weeds. Pull him out of the weeds. Stay on, big boy. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's a nice smolly. It's a real nice smolly. He's so good, I think. Let's go. Nice smolly. Get in. Yes. I didn't want to give up on the spook bait just yet. Let's go, guys. We're going to weigh him just to weigh him because we haven't weighed any fish this. Uh, I don't want him to shake with that either. Dang it. Oh, he's a nice one. At least two pounds or something. Don't shake on my buddy. I don't want no hook on Oh, wow. He's hooked crazily. That's one hook out, and two hooks out. Oh yes, a nice one. That's a nice fish, guys. Beautiful fish. Really nice, too. He is one and a half pounds. You guys probably can't see that. I just wanted to make sure. I didn't think he was two, I didn't think he was like two pounds or anything. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we're done. The wind's coming. I got a spinner trolling on my hat. Oh, I'm 
seen a lot of fish and stuff, but I think we need liver. I don't think the worms are going to do it. And as far as lures go, it's kind of nearly too windy to throw them right now. Down. Taking in water in the front. Alright guys, we'll see you when we get over there. Alright guys, the waves are actually humongous. This is the biggest waves I've ever been on. They're taking water in the front, but it just goes out the drain. It's just supposed to do that. At least a little bit. We got everything tied down. Oh boy. Will we tip the kayak? I'm just getting me going to tip it. She going to dump. Hey, at least we caught a few. I said we did pretty good. Could have caught more. Could have caught about four. We're good. We're good. Hmm. Oh, look at that, guys. I don't think it was. Yeah, it's not supposed to rain today. So I don't know if you guys can see that off in the distance, but it's about to pull. So I'm about to run up to the truck. Like all the mountains are disappearing from the rain. I'm about to run up to the truck, get everything on the kayak, and we gotta get going. The rain is coming. I can literally see it coming. Oh shit! What about the guys? Oh my god! It's starting to rain right now. It's almost to us. We gotta get the. We gotta get my key, and then we gotta get the fish finder. Get the key. The rain is about to pour. It's starting to rain right now. Get the key. Get the key. Roll this up once. Oh my god. Grab this, run, put it up. And we're gonna come down and get everything in the vehicle. Again. I hope my stuff doesn't get blown away. Alright guys, I'll be back. Holy snap. Alright guys. The storm's passed already, but it's the wind storm over there that just hit us. It was crazy. I wish I could have shown you guys when I was trying to get everything off the kayak, but everything's packed, ready to go. Fish finder safe, nothing blew away. I don't know how it didn't, but holy crap, I can't believe it. Alright guys, just got the kayak on. It's bright and sunny out, but the waves are busting still. Man, that was crazy. That's going to be one hell of a video. I went and checked on these other guys that were actually going out right when I was coming in. And I was left, look, you see him on the video, I said, like, good day for kayaking, isn't it? And he's like, crazy weather. I was like, yeah, or something like that, or the other way around. But man, that was crazy. I got out just in the nick of time, like, holy crap. I could see the rain coming when we got, when we got the kayak up on the shore, you could see the rain in the background and everything. That was crazy. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna clean up all my gear. And I'll see you there. All right, you guys, we're back home. I went through all my stuff. I dried off my reels. I dried off the fish finder. I made sure that we had everything. We didn't lose anything. Got all my lures. Everything's good. I'll uh, see you when we catch a big one.